CDT News. Here's why you shouldn't drink water right after eating peanuts. As a child, I was always asked to not drink water right after having a handful of peanuts, especially during winters when we binged on the roasted ones. Well, it was because they believed that drinking water after consuming peanuts could cause cough and irritation in the throat. Although it hasn't been scientifically proven anywhere, but you may agree it does make sense. Many theories have been surrounding this myth or fact, but none of them have been proved. Here are some of the reasons why you shouldn't be sipping on water after munching on these delights. Groundnuts have a tendency to trigger excessive thirst as they are quite dry in nature. One of the most popular reasons why you shouldn't drink water after eating them is the presence of oil in them. Consuming water after having nuts or foods with too much oil content in them may lead to deposition of fat in the food pipe, resulting in irritation and coughing. However, this theory has not been proved as yet. Another theory is that peanuts produce heat in the body, which is why these are available mostly during winters. Drinking water will only disturb the equilibrium as it would put off the heat. Simultaneous heating and cooling of the body causes cold and cough and various other respiratory problems. According to macrobiotic coach and health practitioner, Shilpa Aurora, water after any meal is not recommended as it dilutes digestive juices leading to acidity or indigestion. Some say that it is not like we cannot drink a sip or two, but one must avoid consuming cold water and instead sip on lukewarm water. In fact, it is better to wait for at least 10-15 minutes before drinking a glass. One of the theories is that drinking water after having peanuts causes gastric issues, especially in kids. Sometimes, it can be due to peanut allergy, which is a common condition. You may feel irritation in your throat, followed by other symptoms. Drinking water may only make it worse for you. So ensure that you do not have a peanut allergy. Here's how you can check if you have an allergy. How to check if you have a peanut allergy? Food allergy may be a common condition but only those who go through it can understand how it wreaks havoc on your health and upsets your daily eating habits. On rare occasion, food allergy could be fatal too. One of the most hazardous allergies is peanut allergy. Believe it or not, this tiny nut can trigger a major reaction. Toddlers of parents are often advised to keep their wards off peanuts till a certain age. Peanuts belong to the family of legumes and grow underground. But their function is quite similar to that of nuts like almonds, walnuts, cashews and others. Peanut reaction cannot be restricted to only eating peanuts, but it can range from skin contact, breathing in peanut dust or even eating something prepared with peanut oil. In fact, in some cases, indirect contact can also trigger allergy. For instance, your mother roasted some peanuts in the Kate High and used the same Kate High to make a dish for you. This can completely trigger your allergic reactions. This however is only true in extreme cases. It's true that you cannot know of a certain allergy unless you have consumed the allergen in the first place. However, it is imperative to understand and stop eating those foods the moment you find yourself struggling with symptoms. Peanut Allergy Symptoms Eating peanuts can either trigger allergy on the spot or may take some time to develop. It is good to keep checking for any budding symptoms. Take a look at some of these 1. Itchy skin 2. Red spots on the skin 3. A runny and congested nose 4. An itching or tingling sensation in or around the mouth or throat 5. Shortness of breath or wheezing a severe reaction known as anaphylaxis that may be life-threatening, affecting all your body parts. This is a rare condition. So how can you check if you have a peanut allergy or not? Diagnosing a peanut allergy can be difficult as symptoms may vary from person to person and an individual may not experience the same symptoms during every allergic reaction. There are a few ways through which you can find out the allergy. However, they are not a 100% accurate and a medical practitioner's advice must be sought. If you aren't sure that peanuts may be causing your symptoms, your doctor may recommend an elimination diet. 
Elimination diet is a diet wherein your doctor asks you to eliminate certain suspected foods for about a week or two and then eventually add these items in your diet, one at a time. The process can help you find out the foods causing allergy. Other test is to placing a small amount of food on the skin. If you happen to form a small bump or face any reaction, it indicates you are allergic to the food. Sometimes, in order to find out your immune system's response to particular foods, doctors conduct a blood test. It finds out the amount of allergy type antibodies in your bloodstream. If you are allergic to peanuts, make sure you do not come in contact with them in any way as this may only worsen the symptoms. While it is generally said that you should avoid gulping down water, it hasn't been proven anywhere. But precautions don't hurt. So try and wait for at least 15 minutes before drinking water just to be sure that it would not create a problem for you. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe if you enjoyed the video.